This is a great day, not only for America, for our European and Canadian partners, but it's uh, a great day for planet Earth. Uh, thanks to the team, uh, you all have just been incredible. And over three decades, you've produced this telescope that is now going to take us back in time. It's a time machine. It's going to take us back to the very beginnings of the universe. Uh, we are going to discover incredible things that we never imagined. And isn't that typical of this team? where the impossible comes possible. I can't thank you enough on, on behalf of a, a grateful United States government. I can't thank our, our partners in Europe and Canada enough. Uh, the French uh, launch team, the Ariane Spas, uh, the flawless uh, perfection of the vehicle <clears throat> and now we have to realize there there are still uh, innumerable things that have to work and they have to work perfectly 344 of them but we know that in great reward there is great risk and that's what this business is all about and that's why we dare to explore. The James Webb Space Telescope is very much a part of that exploration. It's significant that we had the delays and it kept us all the way to today, Christmas Day. When others long ago peered up into the sky and saw stars. But it's uh, also uh, another millennia before that, that a shepherd grazing his sheep would look up at the night sky. He became a poet and he penned the words, the heavens declare the glory of God the firmament shows his handiwork. That shepherd, that poet, became king. And those immortal words in Psalm 19 encapsulate the expressions that we have today. The handiwork of God as we peer back in time over 13 billion years ago, capture the light from the very beginning of the creation. My congratulations to the team. My congratulations to NASA, uh, to our partners. Go James Webb Space Telescope.